Hey love bugs, it's Rosalyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite and hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. And for my extended subs, my extended family, well my returning subs, my extended family, that's what I meant to say. Thank you so much for the love and support and for the positive vibes you send me each and every time you drop down on the video. And it is greatly appreciated. With that being said, to everyone, much love to you. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for stopping by my channel. And if you've been watching my videos and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video or if you feel like you're comfortable enough go ahead drop me a line i love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me or even if it's about the content of my video or you just send, send me positive feedback it is greatly appreciated or if you enjoy what you heard spread the word if you resonate with what you have heard go ahead and give me a thumbs up like and even share also it'll greatly be appreciated and thank you so much for stopping by my channel today the relaxing music you hear in the background is 432 hertz of deep healing music for bot my for the body and soul DNA repair relaxation music meditation music so I will post that link in the description box below it's very peaceful especially if you you know if you need to sit there and get answers or if you just you need to hear you know what signs you know like if you always ask God or whoever you pray to what signs do I have that lets me know I'm on that path you know that's something that you can listen to so I very highly recommend that so I've used this before but the video I'm making today all empaths balance your past present and future balance your past present and future and you know there's a lot of times where some of us you know we can have we can go through a lot of tragic things and it's just like man if I wish I could turn back time and I'm not talking about Cindy Lauper song you know if I could turn back time you know I ain't turned about stuff like that but you know it, it's um it's just like, you know, we wish that we could turn back time on certain things, but, you know, it's not meant for us to turn back time, because if it was, you know, they'd be having all type of daggone gadgets where we could go back in time, you know, like Back to the Future, like my J. Fox and all that stuff. But, you know, it's just the point that, like, when we, you know, some people, you know, they do meditation so they can go back in their Akashic records or recordings or whatever you want to call it so they can get answers from their past to see what they're missing because it's like we all go especially through you know indigos and stuff like that you know we go through so much hard time it's like anybody goes through hard time and you know they wish they could turn back time and wish things were different and, you know sometimes with certain situations you know with some people I empathize on the reason why you know but it is just like the tragic things that we go through we can learn lessons from them there's a lot of things that we have went through that we will suppress that knowing we need to go ahead and heal from but it's just like we all have to balance our past present and future it's just you know you have to learn from the past and heal from it you know be able to be in the present and not you know be all of a hot mess you know, you know, I, I'm, I'm prone to be that way every once in a while, especially if certain situations comes up that are very sensitive for me. So it is just like we all have to learn from these things. You know, it's not coming back up to me to hurt us. It's just for you to realize, yes, these things have happened. Yes, you have to learn from them and balance out your life from these these situations. Learn from them. Where, how how far has it brought you? Is it hindering you? Are you letting things go? You have to ask yourself these thousands of questions when these things pop up, and I have to ask myself these things. Or you know, I talk amongst my friends that you know I really truly trust. That you know, I'm just like you know, why am I going through this? You know, and I, I'll be one honest answer because I you know I damn go short. I'm gonna give them the honest answer if they ask me something. You know, but it, it's just like when we go through all these things, it's just like we can become scared. You know, especially if it's something that really, truly traumatizes us. It's like, why would you want to relive these things again? And it's not meant for you to relive them, but it's just 
seem to look at it as a different perspective. You know what I mean? It could be really some really messed up things, but you have to find the positive perspective in that situation. You have to. There has to be a positive situation out of that perspective. You have to be able to find it. You know, and I had to tell myself that, you know, why am I, you know, why are these memories keep reoccurring? Why do I keep seeing myself as a child? Why, why when I see my father, I, I see him this when you know, around the time he had me, because those are the most sore spots for me that is possible. It's like, anytime I, I see him and I start feeling some type of way, it's like pictures from the 1970s and, you know, just the early 1970s and early 80s that keep popping up that are really mess with me. And it was something I had to really deal with. And it's just certain songs that'll come on, you know, really bother me to where, you know, I had me thinking, of, you know, about certain things that I didn't want to think about. But I knew I had to balance myself out because it was just me having, having to realize that my dad's always been there for me. You know, um, that was never alone. And it, it's just like when you're going through these things, you know that you're not by yourself, even though we feel like we are. But it's just like, you know, we go through these situations, you know, so we'll learn from our mistakes, you know, learn, learn from anything that if it might present itself again or recycling. You know how they say things come back and where history repeats itself. And that recurs with scenarios too. So it's like if we go through a situation or, you know, um, <clears throat> or we come across a certain person, it's just like, it's not there for us to put up these walls or whatever, but when it comes to a situation, if it might come up again, you might know how to deal with them. So it's just like when you have to balance these things out, you have to know what your triggers are and what things that motivate you, what your drives are, things that you know you need to heal from the things that you know you need to change the things that you know you need to enhance because for those things then you know you have a better future and you look forward to that future and know that you have a foundation to look forward to and know that it's stable and it's you know it's not rocky because it's like you know you don't want to live in no building or no house where you know the things are you know not all suited up you know the bricks aren't stacked up right the foundation is not laid right you know the floors you know are not all even you know you have to be made, able to make sure that we balance out our things because it's like you don't want to bring your past into your future because they'll mess up your future so these things you have to always realize that you know when the universe presents them to you it's not for punishment it's just for you to open up and will uh, realize wake up everything happens for a reason wake up everything happens for a reason so I hope that you are able to resonate with this video I hope you are able to see something out of it you know if you're going through something know that everything will balance itself out if you put you do your part you do your part then everything else will you know fall into place like a domino effect and know that the universe has got you and i will see you on my next video keep me in your prayers i'll definitely do the same for you send out love and positive vibes to each and every person you come across even if they're rude just say god bless you just keep it moving it'll be okay and much love to you much light namaste like and subscribe you can hit that notification bell Drop me a line. I would love to hear from you. So it's positive vibes. So it'll be appreciated. And I'll see you on my next video. Stay blessed. Stay prosperous. Peace. And be wild.